Hey everybody, it's Jen. I just wanted to kind of announce a few things about um, a new thing we're gonna do here in a few weeks. Um, if you saw my last video, then you might remember that I had some blood work done, like a wellness exam, and they saw that my blood sugar was running high. So since that time, I had um, a A1 test, I think it's called, done. Anyway, it measures your blood sugar over a three month period to see if you really are diabetic or pre-diabetic. And good news, I'm not either of those things. My blood sugar is still running high. Between the highest it's been was 141 one morning. That was scary. And then it's been as low as 98, which really isn't that low. Um, so I still need to watch my sugar, watch my, um, monitor my glucose level rather, and then watch my sugar intake, get more exercise, and do some diet changes. But they also found out though that I have a pretty significant vitamin D deficiency. I guess the normal range is 35 and I'm at 17. So um, I try to avoid the sun because I have this spot here on my neck that we kind of watch and my mom has had some melanoma removed from her face. So I try to stay out of the sun and we'll always wear sunscreen and stuff. And um, yeah, I need to research how to eat, get more vitamin D in my diet, I guess. I'm not a really big, big dairy person either. So I have a plan to meet with the dietitian and come up with a nutrition plan. And I also want to do a sugar detox and water intake challenge. So if any of those things interest you, either of those things, stay tuned because once I meet with our dietitian and we have a plan in place, then I'm going to announce an official start date for a scoot, a sugar scoot, I'm calling it. Scoot out sugar, get it out. So a uh, scoot a sugar challenge and a water uptake challenge. So um, probably <laughs> right before Thanksgiving, I'm sure that's when that will kind of happen. But um, yeah, it's super important and I'm hoping that you'll join me because I need a lot of accountability. I really lack discipline in just about every aspect of my life. It's a problem, you know, so I'm hoping that this might also help me learn some more about discipline too. I'm thinking at least a 21 day detox, sugar detox, and you know, might as well shoot for the same for the water intake. And then hopefully after 21 days, we'll have started some new good habits. So yeah, if you're interested, message me. I think we'll start like a little Facebook hashtag, um, sugar scoot, hashtag sugar scoot, just call it that. And if you're interested, I'll put a post up there and comment on that post and I'll start kind of keeping track of who's down and, and we'll just track it that way and do some stuff on Instagram too. And then hopefully maybe we can have some giveaways at the end. I'm looking into that right now. So, um, yeah, if you're an ambassador or you have products you want to spread the word on, let me know too. We're always looking for that. So yeah, thanks for tuning in and I hope you'll join me because I think this is something probably all of us could work on better or more, especially at holiday time, you know, with Halloween and all the candy still in the house and Thanksgiving pies and Christmas cakes and cookies and it's bad. It's a temptation. I know. So let's, let's do it together. We can do it. We can do it. We can do it. Woohoo! Happy Monday, folks. Talk to you later.